What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more Idol Heroes, and today we're back on the Fortress meme team. Uh, we gotta do some stuff, most importantly our monthly timer is starting to reset, we need to do broken spaces, and one thing I kind of realized on this account, man does this account suck for PvE damaging until we get our Sword Flash, which... We're not that far off, like we're getting close, we're uh, one million away. We're gonna have to get lucky with some cores. Have we been buying cores? Yes, I already used it, I guess. Whoops, didn't even realize that. We also need to make sure we're still doing these game modes. Pushing through Explore is probably something we are gonna have to make sure we do. Uh, and of course, Void Arc, we need to start paying attention to more as well because, well, we are way, way behind on our star spawn and all these things. And as you guys can see, we only picked this account back up very early on here or very late on in the season so we're not even that far in the central hall which means we are missing out on resources so uh besides that not that bad we still have you know one tenant <laughs> oh wait we know we have a shia now oh and we got a rogan wait a minute i totally forgot about all those um Sadly, though, we have, like, no Celestial Island resources because, well, we pretty much quit this account before we did any of that nonsense there. Um, where's Fortress? Is it Dwarven Ruins? There it is. Let's set somebody up down here like that. Sure, it looks good. Let's get our smash in one more time. Get all that taken care of here. Basically, everything's on our Inosuke right now. Like, legit everything is on Inosuke. That's quite a bit upgrading on the tree, which doesn't really do that much. But uh, we need to make sure we're still doing all of these things here. Um, third slot's going to be the best one for us. So let's get as many of these, and then uh, we can always go back and just put a couple pieces in here. There we go. Our visit. I wonder if any of our friends list people even have. <laughs> That's how old so many of those accounts are just unused ones at this point. So let's just go around claiming these guys out. Because really, toolboxes are going to be the hardest things to come by. Now. Sea land. We did get a sea land 20 done. Uh, there's like zero chance we get any of the other sea lands done, and there's zero chance we make any progression here either. I don't think. Like, I think we just get annihilated, like completely obliterated. Nosuke doesn't even get to attack. I mean, he's surviving, he's just not fast enough to go before the enemy is the problem here. <laughs> <laughs> right around 10 he's gotten like two attacks off well actually you know what if he could get an active off <laughs> he can almost clear this wave out that's pretty insane um definitely not gonna get all the way through it though uh you know we should check wow five heroes i'll take it um okay 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 PvE damaging team. Let's deploy a team that I think might do some damage here. I'm gonna put a bunch of like support heroes in. Might as well. Do we have a Death Sworn? We do. The Death Sworn dying would be amazing for us. Um, bu 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 bu. we need to get energy on you so that we get the active off and we're good for a burn. We can upgrade some gear. Honestly, kiss a ghost, not the worst thing in the world for her. Rogan, we can just give him some energy to get going immediately. Heart Watcher, uh, damage reduction is probably best. Nosuke, sure, that's going to be probably the best scenario right here. And then Drake with a Punisher. Yeah, sure, whatever. That's fine. That's going to be our best options. Wow. And I actually forgot our artifact situation. We have upgraded Punisher Staff, upgraded Kiss of Ghost, and upgraded A and B. But the A and B is not maxed out just yet. No pay to an artifact chest, and we are accumulating these. I think that was our goal when we quit this account, was we were going to go... <clears throat> For more of those. One thing I haven't done either is push in our campaign, which I do need to do. But first things first, 
I want to make sure we don't miss out on this rewards here. I'm guessing he's still going to be pretty strong. That's my guess. He's not, I mean, I was going to say he's not that bad. He's actually quite a good PvE damage dealer overall. Uh, we do have him at V4. We don't have any imprints on anybody else just yet. And if we can keep a shield on him, that's perfect, because that means his active is going to have a guaranteed crit chance, which is absolutely amazing. You know, I haven't even checked to see if our main account has done broken spaces this month. It's little things like this that slip through when you're playing, like, five different accounts at the same time. Oh, and if you guys are interested, I think, I think later on today, we are going to start our YouTube streaming again. So if you guys want to check that out, I'll try to post a reminder at the same time of this video. Don't know exactly what time, but it will be a little bit later. Good damage. The Drake is working out good here. Oh, I just can't wait till we get Sword Flash. Like, Sword Flash is just going to open up so many doors for this account. Especially since we already have, like, an A and B and we have a Punisher. Those are two really, really important ones for her. 350. We already got through death, so that's the important part. Let's just smash the rest of these out. Just get our rewards real quick. Because I'm sure it's been years of us watching these battles. I don't think we care at this point what happens in Broken Spaces. It's more or less just the AFK farm spot. Uh, we can take one look at Broken Spaces 7. And then we can also look at 8. So we're going for Aspen first. Looks like it's going to take quite a few attempts here. Yeah, four, I mean, 14 billion is really good, though. Uh, our Fiona is surprisingly doing good damage here. 85% or 15% down to 85, not bad. Uh, this is one. Let's smash one and see how much damage it does. Yeah, probably not enough. <laughs> I don't even think we're doing 1%. Yeah, we're not even doing 1%. So let's just skip over all those. We have all those rewards right there, which are good. 15 more glorious relics are great. We're saving up heroic scrolls. We're saving up profit orders. We need to get paid to win artifacts on this account very, very badly. Up to 300. So we do need to keep working on that as well. We do have almost 2 million stellar shards. So probably what will happen is once we do build our sword flash, we'll reallocate like V1 to a bunch of the householders for sword flash, which are going to be sword flash. Where are you? Uh, Fiona, Sherlock, Inoski. That's perfect. We just got to figure out if we're going to build a Gloria then. So after we build our Shia up, Gloria is going to be the next build, and we don't have any copies of her, so that is going to be a little difficult. Um, we have one Shia right there. Hoping we can get one from this event this week. Is Shia in here, or is she still in Elite Shards? I think she's an elite, right? Yeah, she is. Well, we do have a bunch of them, so... <laughs> no way! <laughs> oh my god, are you serious? We just hit two Shia copies? Hold on, that means we can just upgrade our Shia right now. Good lord, we got food there. We got you there. Oh my goodness, I did not see that coming. We got two copies from the epic charge. No freaking way. I feel like we're high rolling on a bunch of our accounts lately. Um, We do need a 10 star. That's not going to happen anytime soon, I don't think. Well, it could, but I'd have to regress two of you. Ah, screw it. We're going to do it. The stakes made by Barry are going to be rectified. All right, let's just regress all of them. That's fine. We do need to make what? Three six stars then? Oh man, should we just, no, I don't want to regress another one. We need to make some six stars. Non-ticks six stars. Should we can make a Death Sworn one. 
we have any puppets chilling? We do. I think I'm going to cash that in right now for a shadow puppet. Just going to summon those out to have them in the bag too. Um, we got one, two. We need one more. Do a Kamath. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Now we should be able to make a 10 star ticks for food. Where's the ticks? Where's the ticks? We can just use that one there. One, two, three. We got... A puppet we got the three there and then we have nine food one two three four five six seven eight nine there we go food ten star that's gonna make more relics for us as well and that does mean we can take her up to e3 not bad so now we're in a situation where our hero's getting pretty solid stats he's at e3 we do need more 10 stars. We have, we've got plenty of nine stars now. We need a 10 star build, which again, I think is gonna be the next thing we have to like wait on. It looks like most likely, hmm. I mean, we'll potentially get rid of Drake, which is an option. Light or just, uh, we need we would we need more Asmodel copies in the first place. Looks like Abyss might be the next ten star that we build, so we'll just save up some copies and see what we can do. I don't know. It, it's looking good. We got her up to E three, which is perfect. That's gonna be more stats for our Inosuke in the time being. We might as well. Oh wait, yeah, you need to have E five to do Stellar Shards. I kind of forgot. <laughs> Whoops. Um, but yeah, not too bad. So let me know what you guys think. Again, we'll probably get rid of Drake. I know Drake synergizes so well with Sword Flash, but if it's a Fortress mean team, maybe we should only have Fortress heroes, which means we can feed off a Rogan as well, and we only need one more Shia copy. So let me know what you guys think. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this one. I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully, in a live stream later today.